What is up guys welcome to Apex thanks for tuning in the goodlock team has rolled out a brand new update for one of the goodlock modules the sound assistant and this seems to be a very very exciting upgrade we have got this time for this particular module as we all know this particular application the sound assistant provides advanced sound utility for the galaxy phones it adds some advanced features as far as the sound utility is concerned and we can also customize the sound panel using this particular module as you can see the brand new version is 5.1.0.6 and in the change log it talks about three major features one is the flex volume ui support from one ui5 choose effect texture size and control type then we have got dual app volume view support from one ui5 again when the volume of the application is not 100% it appears next to the main volume app volume will be shown with both app volume and media volume the third one is customized voice effects this is supported only on one ui6 provides custom voice creation option now let me break it down for you guys let's check out all these three major features that we have got with this all new update let me open sound assistant module now i'll tap on customize volume panels now here you can see we have got customize volume panel option on the top let me just tap on this at the bottom i have got custom option let me tap on this now you can see here we have got a brand new option dual app volume let's select this as you can see it says when the volume of the application is not 100% it appears next to the main volume let me tell you what this means i have selected this now let me go to the home screen i'll just play some audio on spotify now i'll press on this volume button to increase or decrease it you can see we got two volume bars now one is the main volume bar which is the common volume bar for everything on the phone i mean to say all the audios on the phone and the second one is the application which is currently running is showing up right next to the main volume bar now this will show up only if the application volume is below 100% now let me just take this volume of this particular application the spotify to 100% now when i press the volume button it doesn't show the volume for this particular application it only shows the main volume bar since the app volume is at 100% that is the first important feature we have got now with this update now let's look at the second one this is very exciting for all those customization freaks out there now we have got a brand new customization option to create our own volume panel colors let me just tap on make your own volume panel colors you can see this looks just crazy isn't it we have got something called flex volume ui uh, we have got two tabs at the bottom flex ui and then theme theme was something which was already there this looks redundant now i would say looking at the flex ui the theme options look quite boring now you can see under flex ui the one which we have selected is right here on the top and we have got all these lighting effects at the bottom these have got some dynamic gradient effects with some vibrant colors we have got 10 different lighting effects to choose from we can select the one we want let me just select any of these I will go to home screen just to show you guys how it looks. Let me press the volume up button. This is how the single bar looks and when I expand it by tapping on the three dot button, you can see we have got all these four bars with this effect and the application volumes are shown in the normal theme. Now these are the app volumes which I have separately selected under settings. If I don't want them, I can get rid of them. Now under flex volume UI, we cannot customize it further. We will only have to select the ones which are currently available. Probably in the future updates the good lock team will allow us to further customize these gradient color effects or these lighting effects let's wait and see that now let me just get back to the flex volume ui i will just scroll down a bit you can see we have got options to select texture we have got mesh and acrylic texture options and if i go further down we have got control type we have got bar and knob control option now let me just select knob control option and show you how it looks you see this is in circular form you can move your finger on the circle in circular motion to increase or decrease the volume the border of the circle glows up and we also have haptics here when you increase or decrease the volume you can see the phone vibrating that is pretty cool we get two different sizes for this round shaped volume panel here this is quite a comprehensive customization option we have got now for the volume panels now let's look at the third and the final feature that we have got with this update that is customized voice effects to check this out let's go all the way down under sound and vibration effects we have got voice changer now this was a game changing feature which goodlock team added on the sound assistant module this helps us disguise our voice 
while playing games or while using some of the applications. Under this voice changer, we've got an all new option right here at the bottom. You can see we have got customized voice effects. Uh, apart from these preset voice effects that we have got, we can customize this further. We can tap on customize voice effect to see all these sliders. We've got echo delay, echo ratio, tremolo frequency, tremolo intensity, vibrato frequency, vibrato intensity, pitch level, all these can be customized according to our preferences. Now, I'm not sure how many of you guys use this particular feature, but yes, this is fun and this can be useful for some of you out there. Now, as far as I'm concerned, the most exciting feature for me is the Flex Volume UI and also the Dual App Volume View. Let me know which one is your favorite feature. Drop a comment and while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel to stay updated with your Samsung Galaxy phones and all the new features and updates that you get will be posted on this channel. So be sure you subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find this information. Thanks for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.